Hello everybody, Jesse Dusty here. Welcome back to some more Hot Sauce Golf 4. Yeah, I've been uh, away for a few weeks. I've been dealing with a cold, but I'm better now, and we've been dealing with COVID, believe it or not. So yeah, that wasn't really that fun. I mean, everyone in my family here is okay. It's just uh, we haven't been able to do much of anything. But I haven't really been able to uh, be motivated enough during the time to make some videos, especially ones with commentary because, well, for one, nobody was able to go out of the place, so I couldn't really do much commentary in the first place, but also I've been, I've been thinking about uh, whether I'm going to be continuing to do this after this year. You're smarter than I thought. Yeah, so tonight's meal will be disgusting. I'm not sure whether I'm going to continue to do this after this year. This might very well be my last year of uploading content. And it's not because I don't want to upload more content. I do want to do this full time. I do love doing this. But everything in real life is preventing me from doing this full time. So my finances are not where they should be. I'm not able to uh, support myself doing this. My current living situation is not ideal. I'm trying to uh, get myself into a better living situation so I could maybe do this full time. But uh, yeah, and there's some other stuff that I need to work on as well. And everything is just pulling me away from uploading content. So, after this year, I think this might be my last uh, year. Don't go in the bunker, come on. Oh, you suck. Oh, no, wow, barely on the edge of the fairway there. But yeah, um, I do have a Patreon, but uh, not for the reason of wanting to get money to uh, do anything. I'm uploading stuff over there for your guys' enjoyment that I can't upload on YouTube due to uh, different uh, reasons. So for instance, Burnout 3 Takedown, uploading on YouTube. I can't do that because with the soundtrack, with the soundtrack, um, Burnout 3 is being blocked worldwide on YouTube. So I can't really upload there, but I have it on, on my Patreon for everyone to see. And another one is Outlaw Golf 2. And that's the same reason for Burnout 3. It's not being blocked everywhere on YouTube, but uh, it's better to be shown on a different site. So I have a walkthrough of Outlaw Golf 2 going up on my Patreon as well. It's not with commentary, it's a walkthrough. And I'm being I'm playing it on the Xbox instead of the PS2. And I love the Xbox version of the game. So it's not only does it support widescreen support on the Xbox. But also because well um it's able to get the Xbox version shows more in the background. It's uh, it's widescreen, so you be you be able to see more of the surroundings. And overall, I think it just uh, it just looks and sounds a bit better than the PS2 version. So that's why I'm playing the Xbox version of the game. 
I was thinking about uh, uploading a comparison video between the PS2 and Xbox versions of Outlaw Golf 2, but uh, with the soundtrack, that's not really going to be possible. Of course I could turn the soundtrack off, because the soundtrack is not really needed for the comparison, so I could still do that and show you some main differences between the two, but I haven't played the Xbox version so that much to uh, clarify some of the differences. So you are quite powerful. Are you serious right now? The ball just loves going into the sand trap for some reason, but there's a hill around the bunker, so that's why it just keeps swirling in. Um, I'm trying to uh, get past this tournament here, and I failed a few times because I've gotten a few um, bogey types that I haven't been able to come back from, so that's why I'm trying to do this again. Um, Yeah, there we go. You're the king of the beach. It landed safely. That didn't go as far as I wanted it to. Give it a clinker. Oh wow. Perhaps more mustard. I'm not Give really gonna to get right, this one. Right. Um I probably should have hit a little harder than that. Always room for improvement. A bit more mustard. Yeah, I didn't hit that hard. It would have gone in either way, though. Hmm. Your obscurity grows. All right, what else? Um, yeah. Yeah. Um. So many thoughts are going through my mind right now. I'm trying to focus on what uh, I should talk about, other than trying to get past this tournament, because this is a difficult course. That uh, you uh, really wanna, you really wanna try and uh, be careful going through this course, cause you never know what could happen. So this it's, is a cause for celebration. it's very easy to get bogeys on here, to go under sand traps, go out of bounds. So you gotta take it a little slow and think about the shots you wanna do. I sometimes have a little habit of rushing my thoughts when I don't need to. Okay, there's a stinking bunker right here and I don't like that. Alright. Smashing good. I think I'll be good with the par here. I would prefer a booty, but I'd have to ship it in to make it happen. Which I could do, but the wind is not working with me here. So... Oh, uh, yeah, it went in. Oh, okay, cool. Nice. Alright, yeah. You got it. Good job. Anybody want an autograph? No. Not really. Win the tournament and then I'll get your autograph. How about that? Yeah, that seems to be a good idea. Alright, um, other stuff that I have on Patreon, um, I'm just about finished with my Donkey Kong 64 replay for Patreon. So I'm just, I, I'm done the recording, I just, I just have to finish the editing, which shouldn't take that long, and I'll have it uploaded on Patreon very soon. I'll leave a link to the Patreon in the description below for you to check out. And if you're wanting to uh, check out the stuff I have on Patreon, then uh, you can do so. And if you want to help support the channel, and if you want me to uh, continue to upload past this year, 
then it would be greatly appreciated. Although, I still don't know what I'm going to be doing after this year. I have to work on my real life stuff first and get myself into a comfortable situation where I could do this full time. I do want to uh, upgrade my editing program though. Get in there, come on. There we go. Would you like to put on your Ooh, another one for Team Velvet? Ha! I do want to upgrade my editing program, because I've been using PowerDirector by Cyberlink for years, and it's a simple program, and I can speed through the editing with that program, but there's not as many features as you would like, and Therefore, I can't really make it look more professional like uh, a lot of the other uh, videos on YouTube that uh, other people have done. It landed safely. Give it a clunker. So, I am wanting to upgrade from PowerDirector to Adobe Premiere Pro. I have tried Sony Vegas, but that program was a little too complicated for me to go through and I couldn't really edit that much that I wanted. I tried to uh, edit an HDR recording in Sony Vegas but it didn't really work out the way I wanted it to so I don't, I don't even think I edited the HDR recording right. Because I was going to upload, like, uh, around an hour uh, video of Rise of the Tomb Raider on PlayStation 5 with HDR, but uh, I don't think it came out right in Sony Vegas, so I can't really upload that, and I don't know if... Oh, wow, the wind is really strong. I did not even notice that. Okay. Do you have any boots? That was on me. That was on me. I don't like these two uh, bunker placements though. Uh, okay. Okay, let's try that. Uh, that's gonna go in the bunker. Probably. I should have moved the... Oh, wow. That just barely made it over the bunker. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. Right there. Ooh. This is a cause for celebration. Oh boy. Ah, I could I could probably ship that in. I did it before, I can do it again. Although this is not looking good. Um let's go a little bit over here. Oh yeah, definitely. Okay. Stayed in the air too long now. Why not hit it left? Hmm. Son of a quark. Oh. Yeah, that's unfortunate. It's fine though, it's fine. I didn't pay attention to the wind at the beginning, so that was my fault. This hole is uh, not very friendly because it is the green is high up over there and you need a very high trajectory to make it over but you also need to drive it a lot farther than you would think otherwise you're not gonna make it over so I'm not gonna try it again this time because I failed both times even with Ratchet here I have failed making, making it over there, so I'm not going to go over there again. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be safe about this and go the long way. So I'm just about done with my Donkey Kong 64 replay for long play. It's, uh, it's a bit longer. It has taken me a bit longer to get through everything. So if you've seen my DK64 playthrough on YouTube, 
them it's going to be a bit longer than that. I have not skipped or sped through any of the text that is shown in the game. I've done uh, things a bit differently. Of course I was trying to speed through the game as much as I can, but... I don't know, some things just take uh, a bit long to do. Would you like to put on your phone? Anybody want an autograph? I think right now I have left to edit the sixth and seventh world along with the final area. And right now in my editing I think I'm around seven hours. Let's see. Uh, it's not doing anything right now. Okay, I think it's around seven hours, but... Ooh, this is a part five. This is a good chance to do this. Let's go over here. Oh! And Ratchet does not have a high trajectory. I thought he did, but he does not. When when we was when we were selecting the character, you see the trajectory arrow pointing up. It's highlighted green, so that means it's mid level trajectory, not high. Otherwise it'll be red with an H beside it. Low trajectory would be blue with an L beside it. Green is mid level, so it's not as high as you would want it to be and therefore on the previous hole that's why he's not able to make it onto the green, which is a bit too high for his trajectory level. If he hit a lot further than his uh, normal um, distance, then he might have a chance, but, you know. Even with backspin and perfect impact, which would help lift the ball a bit higher, you, know, you need more distance for it to reach the green on a mid-level trajectory. Um, there is water over here though, and I don't like that. That's also gonna overshoot the hole. Get down, ball, seriously. Yeah, I did hit a bit too hard there. Oh well. And what other stuff I have on my Patreon, um, I have the Banjo Tui uh, long play replay as well. So if you've seen uh, my uh, previous um, status post on YouTube, you'll know that I have uploaded my Banjo Tui replay on uh, my Patreon. My Benjo 3 playthrough on my YouTube channel was about 10 hours. It's, uh, my replay is 12 hours because I've done everything in the game to get 100%. Uh, in there. There you go. I'll gladly fix that one. Another one for Team Velvet. I am doing better than I have before though. I did get one double bogey, but when I was at the when I finished the ninth hole in the previous attempt, I was down over par not under par, so I am doing better this time around. Maybe because I'm not going as fast as I usually do. As Mel, one of the characters in this game, as Mel would say, slow and steady wins the race. So yeah, you gotta do that when you're on a difficult course. Take your time, get your shots lined up, 
Not like that, though. And you should be fine going through. They put... What? Right on the edge. That's stupid. Um... There we go. You are quite powerful. I know. Whoop. There we go. That's looking good. The birdie is a sacred thing. Why not hit it left? Would you like to put on your phone? Anybody want an autograph? <laughs> Ooh, Jerry got a bogey. How awesome is that? Okay. Um, I believe that's about everything I have on Patreon after our oh, crop. Yeah, that's going in the water. I didn't bring my suit. Wow, can we, like, not hit the red spots on the meter, please? For the love of... what? This is not good. I really don't want to have a downward, uh, trend on the back nine. Okay. Oh, boy. Just hit it softly. Hit it to the right, right? Get in there. Thank you. At least you bothered to show Son up. Son of a quark. Oh. Okay. Um, I believe that's everything I have on Patreon right now. I'm doing the walkthrough about Log Off 2. I've got my Burnout 3. Takedown long play on there. I've got uh, Benjo Tui on there, the whole replay of that. And I'm about to upload Donkey Kong 54. And I have uh, plenty more videos to uh, upload there. It's just gonna take me some time because I'm trying to uh, work on uh, the real life stuff. I spoil YouTube stuff. I'm not sure what I'm gonna be doing. Um, George, I think he's got it. I do have the rest of this to go through. Um, I do have Hot Shots Golf Out of Bounds to walk through to do. I'm old, Mario Golf walk through. And yes, I have uh, checked out the new Mario Golf game coming to the Switch. The trailer for that game and. I'll possibly be doing that one as well. It just looks and plays uh, quite a bit different than the old Mario Golf games. Um, it plays a bit like. I'm going to pass out another one for Team Velvet. It plays a bit like Wii Sports Golf, in a way. At least with the, the swinging of the club. Um, you have a, a swing meter on the side of the screen, and the more it's filled up, the harder the shot. But it's also curved to let you know what kind of uh, shot you're going to do, and that's basically... Uh, how we sports did it, so it's gonna be playing a bit like that, which is interesting. So, I am excited to try the game out, but uh, I don't know if it's going to be my favorite Mario Golf, because it's my favorite Mario Golf will always be told to a tour. I did think uh, the original uh, Mario Golf on the N64, I always had that as my favorite, and it still is. So I guess they're both tied for first place, I guess, for my favorite Mario Golf game. 
64 and Toad Store Tour. And I did do a full playthrough walkthrough of Toad Store Tour on my channel. So if you wanna check that out, if, if you like the game, then go for it. But yeah, um, I don't have Advanced Tour, so I can't really do that. Although I would like to, but with the game collecting I'm doing these days, I'm trying to find uh, games that are complete, not cartridge only, so yeah, I'm going, uh, I'm trying to find a complete copy, so when I find a complete copy of Advanced Tour, then I will gladly uh, pick it up and I could probably do a uh, playthrough of that. I am interested in that one because of the story mode in that game. And the new Mario Golf is also going to have a story mode, but uh, I don't know. I am looking forward to it though. Because I do like the story mode for, for some game. Get in there! Oh, come on, really? Simon, you couldn't have just booted the ball into the hole? Come on, man. Your cat, you're, you're, cat, you're supposed to kick the ball into the hole. Nah, he's not gonna do that. Oh well. Teresa, how dare you get an eagle? You're not supposed to do that. Wow. Okay. Um, I have other Mario sports games that I could do for the channel. Um, I do have Mario Strikers for the GameCube. That is a, a fun soccer game, and I love that. Uh, I I bought it either last year or the year before, but I haven't played it once. I don't think. <laughs> I don't know why. But uh, I, I will be it. getting to it pretty soon. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do a playthrough of it for YouTube soon, but uh, I will do it this year, I think. I just have to get back into the swing of being in that game and find out how to play it again. Like I did uh, kind of forget how to play it. It's been a long time. And I do have Mario Baseball as well. So that would be pretty fun to play. Um, if I'm going to do 100% in Mario Superstar Baseball, at least for tour mode, then that's gonna take quite a while. It landed safely. Cause there's different seasons, there's the different levels of difficulty, and left? there's the star missions we have to get for every character. And that's gonna take a while to complete them all. Especially when there's some missions that you can only do on a set difficulty, I think. Oh, come on, really? You just had the curb that much? Oh. Your obscurity grows close enough. Jerry got an eagle. How dare you? Well, I am, I am at least doing better than I have in the previous attempt, so. The best score for this one is a bogey. I need to fix that immediately. I I would like to take the shortcut here though. The only problem is taking a small area to hit the ball to, and it's you can easily get out of bounds. So I don't think I'm gonna try it. I also don't like that stupid. Bunker placement over there. Um, let's try over here. Come on. Smashing good. Get on the fairway. Oh, sure. Go into the. Okay, semi rough. That's okay. That's better. Alright. 
Oh, come on, Willy. Okay. It's on the fairway, so that's the important thing. Um... That's not gonna curb as much as I want. Yeah. It landed safely. Give it a clinker. Perhaps more mustard. There we go. Would you like to put on your fur? Anybody want an autograph? I believe that's all the Mario Sports games that I have. I do have Mario Golf World Tour on the 3DS, but I have no way to uh, record the handheld system, so that is out of the question. Game Boy Advance, I can do because I have the uh, Game Boy Player for the GameCube, but 3DS, not so much. I do have, Smashing good. I have been uh, doing um, a, I have been doing a big collection. I have been collecting a lot of games in the past year, since uh, last summer, and uh, I was thinking of maybe doing a uh, game collection update video. I don't know if you guys would want to see it though. It's not as big as, uh... Oh wow, that just barely made it over. It landed safely. It's not as big as some uh, other people's uh, collections. Because I've, I've had a bit of a habit of buying digital games as opposed to physical copies. So that's why my collection isn't as big. But it is much bigger than what I had a couple years ago. Would you like to turn on your fur? Another one for team building! Huh. So I've been collecting some collector's edition, limited edition stuff. Um, People always play their best against me. If you don't know have you guys heard about the Strictly Limited uh, website? Strictly Limited? Well, those guys on that website have, are selling um, limited edition stuff. Basically, I got a game over, bought a game there that uh, are not sold here in America. So, that's also something else. Um, this is a cause for celebration. Yeah. I think that's uh, just about everything I safety. wanted to say in the video. Here. I'm old, please hurry. Um, just hit it softly. Letting you know what, uh, it what have been going on in the past year. Oh, come on, really? I hate the ball. This ball sucks. Very common. Close enough. Oh well. <laughs> it is good to be recording videos again, at least with uh, this game because heavens, it's almost over. I'm enjoying playing this game. Uh, this game is uh I don't know if it's my favorite hot shot golf game. It might be. I tried to back out of that shot and I could not do that. Dang it. I wanted to... I wanted to cancel that shot and do a power shot, but too late for that. Um, boy. This is not good. Um... Ow. Hit the hill and come back. Oh, oh wow. Oh boy. 
Well, I could try and do a.、Um, I could try and hit the、um, left black spot on that meter, and send the ball sky high and get over the、uh, rock. But I don't think it'll be worth it, cause Jerry is only two behind me, and if I try it and screw up, yeah, that's not gonna be good. So I'm gonna have to、uh, do this safely. Okay, 179. Oh boy. Oh come on. You are quite powerful. That ball has eyes. Okay. Oh wow. I'm on my toes. <laughs> That was a good shot. <laughs> If only it went in. If only. Okay, it's better to have gotten a par than a bogey. Cause if he gets an eagle, which he did, <laughs> ah, I'm happy I didn't take that risk. Cause if I did, he got an eagle, he would have won. Oh boy, I'm glad I did it safely in that one. <sighs> I I.、Uh, in Mario Golf, you can back out of a shot and then do it again. In this game, you cannot do that, and I found that out the hard way. Ah,、uh, boy. Stupendous. It's all in a day's work. At least we won, though. That's the important thing. Whew. And next stage trial, World Star, is now available. Ooh. I'm going to put tape on you. Wanna be my new sidekick? New record for everything, except longest putt. Wow.、Well, so, better score, better points, longest shipping, 21 yards. I didn't think that was gonna go in, but it did.、Uh, best drive, average new pin, par pace, and perfect impact. Wow, not bad, not bad. All right, can I get a good prize? Well, it's better than a pinch hit coupon. Wild green mirrored. Okay, good. I don't have the back tee though. That sucks. But at least we unlocked the mirror version of the course. That's something. All right, we got Mike's costume, so at least we don't have to buy it in the shop. Hi, how can I help you? So we got. One, two, three, four, five more costumes to buy. Hmm. Have a nice day. All right, that's good. Okay, so what about for Mike? What does he what? United Forest GC Bakti Mirrored Stage Trial. Finish with a score of five under par and no backspin. I hate you. We want backspin. Topspin would have been better. Come on. Ah、oh, well, at least it's not、uh, a three plus two. Don't be stupid. Ah、oh, well, I guess we can't do backspin, which sucks. So that means、uh, we can't hit a little harder than the、uh, green and have the ball come back. So we gotta. Adjust our power a bit more on that one. Now, well, we'll do that at some point. I mean, we'll do it after the next bullshit mode match, obviously.、Uh, Mike, where are you? There you are. All right. So we got these two, and then these two will come later. Well, no, these two will come after he has his loyalty go up, and these two is basically.、Uh, A snow outfit, a winter outfit, basically. Orange and green. All right, interesting choice. All right, so next time we'll go to Bosu's mode, 
Um, I still don't know who I'm gonna face off against yet, though. Oh well, I'll figure it out. I do have to play against these guys again, but... We'll figure it out. Last time we faced off against Renee with Lin and destroyed her in that one. So next time we'll be a dude. So I'm thinking maybe Hubert or Sam. One of those two guys. Alright, so that's been Jesse. That's you. Hope you enjoyed. Later.